What's up YouTube? It's your girl Jasmine. Welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to show you how I work my adjustable straps in my wigs and my half wigs. And as you can see my little diva, she right here next to me. But anyway, this was a request video. Someone asked me how do you do the adjustable straps and I know sometimes as easy as it sounds, sometimes it can be very difficult. So first thing, adjustable straps are made to help your wigs fit the shape of your head. In every wig there should always be an adjustable strap, even in half wigs, lace fronts. That's that's what it should be nowadays. There are some wigs that may not even have those, but for the most part, you will definitely find wigs that have the adjustable straps. If not, they have the combs. You get lucky for both of them. So, the first thing I want to show you, I'm just using the lace front wig that I have here. And I hope you guys can see this. Let me just scoot on Scoot it down a little bit. Okay. Now, the adjustable straps are located right before the nape of the wig. Now, this is the nape. This flap right here is the nape. Right where that comb lies in the back, that's the nape of your wig. And that's going to lay on the, on the nape of your head. Right above the nape is your adjustable straps which are going to lie right behind your ear it's going to lie right behind your ear so you're going to have two one on your right side and one on your left side so here is a strap here and it's connected through this loop to keep it tame to keep it from flying away so whenever you do have your adjustable strap if this ever comes out of this loop here just make sure you slide it through there so that the strap won't go flying everywhere so this is one side with the strap and then you have one on the other now the entire nape of your half wig or your lace front wigs or whatever wig you have are going to have different are going to have not different but they're going to have slots you can see there's a slot here a slot here and they're going to go all the way to the other side now, first thing you want to do is try on your wig. Try your wig on. Is it loose? Okay. Take it through the first slot. So this is the hook. This hook right here is what you're going to insert into the slot to secure your wig and make it tight. So when I try my wig on, if it's too loose, what I do is I stick it through the first slot just to see how that works out. So as you can see, the first slot is going to be on the edge here. So you take your adjustable strap. And make sure that your strap is facing downward. Your hook is facing downward. So you go ahead and you see that hook right here? You're going to go ahead and place it inside that hook. Just like that. And that's how it goes in. And you see it stretches. You go ahead and try it on again. If it's too tight, your strap is going to be connected into this loop right here to keep it to keep it from flying away. So make sure that if your strap is not in this loop, put it in this loop so that your strap won't fly away. Now try on your wig and if it's too tight then you go ahead and you don't really have to worry about the straps but if it's too loose take it through the first slot. Now this is the first slot and make sure that your hook is facing down. So basically what I do is I take my hook and this is the slot and I go ahead and put it in like that and that is going to be secure as you can see and it does stretch you go ahead try your wig on if it's too loose you take it out and then move it down to another hook this is like the third hook actually and then just keep going make sure that you adjust um, the straps accordingly on the same side make sure you if you do it like if you do your strap on the third hole, make sure you do it on the third hole on the other side too, just so you can have some evenness. And just like I did this side, I'm going to go ahead and take it and go 
into this hook. Like that. Now and the slots go from the um where the strap ends. The slots is out throughout the entire nape of the wig. See these are all these are all slots that you can use. So you can tighten it as far as like here. So if your head really small, you can go ahead and tighten it as close and as tight as you need to. Now I see hi YouTube. See what's going on? Jada want to say hi. But anyway, that's how you work the adjustable straps. I normally don't use them because my wigs normally fit well. But if you don't use them, just make sure you cut this off. Make sure you cut this off because it can get latched onto your hair and it creates this straggleness, this straggity, raggedy look. So pretty much that's it. I hope that this tutorial has helped you all today and I'm going to pick up Jada because she's acting up. I hope this tutorial helped you guys and if you have any more other questions be sure to let me know and I hope you all have a great day and good luck with your straps. Talk to you later. Bye.